the profit formula determines which receivables and costs should be considered in your front-end, back-end, and gross profit. Front-end profit typically refers to the profit generated from the initial sale of a vehicle. Back-end profit, on the other hand, typically refers to the profit generated after the initial sale. It often involves additional revenue streams that come from upselling or cross-selling, among other things. For dealers this usually includes warranties and service contracts. Gross profit typically represents the difference between total revenue and the cost of goods sold. Although Desk Manager Online comes with a default profit formula, profit calculations vary widely between dealerships. If you are unsure whether a receivable or cost applies to the calculation method at your business, speak with your accountant. Auto Manager cannot decide what should apply to your profit calculations. Take a moment to review and revise your profit formula. This will ensure your profit and commissions are always accurately calculated. For existing Desk Manager users, before making any changes to the profit formula, reference a deal to see how your profit is currently being calculated. Navigate to a deal, then click the Recap button along the top banner. Any item considered in the profit calculation will appear in the detailed breakdown. Using this deal as an example, manually calculate the profit according to your dealership and compare this to the total desk manager online profit. Once you understand what is or isn't being calculated in the profit, you're ready to make changes to the profit formula calculation. Please note that any changes to the profit formula will only affect pending deals. Sold deals will retain their original profit calculation. First click the settings cogwheel. Then under the deal category, select profit formula. On the left is a column of either receivables or costs. Items with green text are receivables. Items with red text are costs. On the right, you can check the box to apply that receivable or cost to either the front end, back end, or gross profit calculation. After enabling or disabling items based on your profit comparison, click Save and Close in the top left. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions or issues, please reach out to our technical support team.